Hey there fellow readers, Mrs. Weidman here, and today we're going to be talking about the exciting, action-packed, wilderness survival story, Jumper, by Melanie Crowder. Um, and this book follows a 19-year-old girl, and her name is Blair Scott. And Blair has really just one goal in life, and all she has ever wanted to do since she was kind of a young teenager, right, is become a notorious, or just become a smoke jumper. And for those of you that don't know, smoke jumpers are actually wildland firefighters. So it's their job to kind of live out in these remote sort of places, right? And whenever a lightning strike happens or whenever some other spark ignites a really small fire out in the forests of North America or out in the deserts of North America, it's their job to actually hop on board a plane. They fly out to these super remote areas and they actually jump out of the plane, right, land on the ground, and it's then their job to fight the fire and extinguish it so the fire can't blow up into a full-blown forest fire or wildland fire, and it can't pose any challenges, right, or dangers to the people who might live in these super remote areas or, of course, destroy the forest. Um, so Blair is really excited to do this in her life. However, she knows she kind of has to wait. Well, unfortunately, in this book, which is kind of what we're seeing in the United States today, Right, fire seasons are getting more and more dangerous every year. They're lasting longer and the fires are burning hotter. And so because of this, the Wildland Forest Service actually um, invites another class of smoke jumpers to apply in the middle of fire season, which is not how it usually goes down. So even though Blair is only 19, she and her best friend Jason apply to become smoke jumpers. They get accepted into the course. And then for the most of the story, they're actually learning just what it takes physically mentally to become a true smoke jumper and have the kind of bravery and guts it takes to go out into the middle of nowhere, jump out of a plane, and of course put out some fires. I will have to be completely honest with you, I was had high, high hopes for this book. I was really wanting it to be so much better than it was. <laughs> um, however, it is still a good read for anybody who likes action stories, who likes survival stories, who's interested in wildland firefighting or kind of just what it takes um, to be that kind of courageous and that kind of brave. Um, hope to see you all online soon.